Okay, everybody. There's a lot of lives at stake here. So let's go over the plan one more time. Look, I stay with the vehicle. I honk twice if I see the fuzz. Check. Darla. I kept the fence. You facilitate access to the detainees. And how do I do that, Larry? You cut the fence. <laughs> Check. You want to do it the easy way? Sure. Happy Thanksgiving! You're free! Run for your lives! Run for your lives! Hurry up! Shh, shh, shh. Keep it down, boys. This way. This way. This Come on. Way. Come on. 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 It's such a rush to liberate our fellow creatures. You feeling what I'm feeling? <laughs> uh, uh, guys, 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 our fellow creatures are wandering back into the pen. Well, that's okay. If just one of them escapes the white man's axe, we've done our job. Or at least he had a brief taste of freedom. Sure I can't get you something to drink, Gregory? Oh, no thanks, Dad. I'm fine. News, Edward. Bunny Stanton is out of Betty Ford. Oh, bully for Bunny. Here, here. <laughs> hey, everybody. Sorry I'm late. My parents and I were just... <laughs> hey, everybody. <laughs> Hi, so did you ask them yet? Ask us what? Well, it's uh, kind of a crazy idea, and you probably won't go for it, but uh, Dharma wants to have Thanksgiving at our house, and she wanted me to ask you if you wouldn't mind maybe coming over. Wow, that's exactly how you ask for morning sex. <laughs> so, what do you think? I, 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 I don't know. What, what was the question? Thanksgiving, our place. Oh, oh, well, that's, that's very kind of you, Dharma, dear. But, you know, we have standing reservations at the Mark. You guys go to a restaurant on Thanksgiving? Oh, yes. It's much, much easier. I can have my turkey, Edward can have his surf and turf, and they make the most wonderful pumpkin bisque. Oh, well, I can cook all that. What's bisque? Soup. What's surf and turf? Dama, dear, why don't you and Gregory just join us? No. Come on, we'll get the whole family together at our place. You guys, my folks, will be great. Yes. Yes, yes, it, it, it would be fun. Um, uh, but you couldn't possibly cook for six in that tiny little kitchen of yours. Dharma, she does have a point. Yes. Well, can I use your kitchen? <laughs> Well, I would love that, of course, but you know, I give the servants Thanksgiving off so that they'll work at Christmas. Well, that's okay, you and I will cook. <laughs> oh, come on, that's funny. Okay, I'll cook. Come on, show me around the kitchen. <sighs> Very well. Kitty, it's this way. <laughs> Right you are, right you are. All right. All right. So your parents gonna have their usual Thanksgiving feast? Yep. Well, no, let me guess. Tofu turkey with celery bones. <laughs> you just think they're complete weirdos, don't you? I'm sorry. That wasn't fair. Thank you. As a matter of fact, they don't eat at all. <laughs> they don't eat at all? They fast. They fast. They protest, you know, the, the exploitation of the Indians, the destruction of the environment, the Nixon stamp. The Nixon stamp? They wanted the young, thin Nixon. So let me get this straight. While we're stuffing our faces, they're just going to sit there and not eat? Oh, sometimes they sing about not eating. 
Dharma, Dharma, I'm begging you. Please don't put our parents together for an entire day. Nothing good can come of it. Hey, that's not true. The more time they spend together, the better they'll get along. And then when we have kids, we don't have to choose which grandparents I'll spend the holidays at. Well, I can't argue with that. Thank you. So I'll just beg. Please don't do this. <laughs> Greg, relax. It'll be fun. Besides, you don't have to worry about a thing, because Jane and I are going to take care of the shopping and the cooking like a couple of good old-fashioned housewives. Cool! I love when we do old-fashioned housewives. <laughs> so, this is going to be the best Thanksgiving ever, Mitch. I agree, Madge. Shall we pop over to the produce section for fresh vegetables? <laughs> now why? When all the vegetables we could possibly want have been frozen for our convenience. No more cleaning. No more chopping. What will we do with all that extra time? Why, that's a very good question. Perhaps we should talk to our family physician about barbiturates. Gosh, all this modern science really is making our lives better. <gasps> Say, Midge, is that that young go-getter, Pete Cavanaugh? Madge, doesn't he work at the office with your husband? Oh, yes, he does. <gasps> and you had sex with him at our wedding. <laughs> oh, right. I thought he looked familiar. <laughs> you Pete Cavanaugh. Okay, I give up. <laughs> oh, well, we are saving money by shopping in the 50s. Something got you down. You're hanging a puss. <laughs> Frozen turkey dinner, envelope of gravy, gee willikers. Could this be a Thanksgiving for one? No. My cat might join me. Oh, well, one or two, that just won't do. You're having Thanksgiving with us. But only if you get in our car and be the baby. <laughs> All right. Man, the first guy to eat one of these must have been really hungry. Oh, dude, check it out. His mom packed him a lunch. <laughs> How's everything going? Oh, Kitty, I'm glad you're here. Um, where's the potato masher? Oh, I told you, I gave her the day off. <laughs> so, when do you girls anticipate serving dinner? One moment, let me consult with my assistant. <laughs> we don't know. Oh, good Lord. Well, don't just criticize. Why don't you help us out? What can I do? She does have a point. <laughs> Never mind. All right, chop chop, back to work. We need a pan for the turkey. We need a pot for Edward's lobster. Where's the lobster? I don't know. <laughs> well, where did you put him? Right over here, by the turkey. Key. <laughs> I gotta tell you, Greg, this is great. Being in a warm family gathering like this. Pete, I'm at my parents' house. Where are you? <laughs> Shh, can't hear Willard Scott. <laughs> Hola, Casa Montgomery. Un momento, por favor. Senora Montgomery! What are you doing? Can't answer my own phone. That's how rumors start. <laughs> Yes, Mrs. Montgomery here. No, 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 we definitely want to hold that reservation. Mm hmm Thank you. Bye-bye. What reservation? Our Thanksgiving table at the Mark. You didn't cancel it? Oh, Gregory, darling. Every young bride thinks that she wants to cook a Thanksgiving dinner, and it always ends up the same. Someone cries, someone is rushed off to the emergency room, <laughs> and a perfectly lovely bird gets wasted, which, if I don't eat soon, will be me. <laughs> I'm sure everything's fine. I'll go check. <laughs> ah, there's Bullwinkle. <laughs> Get out of there! Are we on lobster free? <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. You have any?
letting me put the turkey in the oven? Well, now, I can't do that till I get the lobster out of him, now can I? <laughs> the lobster is inside the turkey. <laughs> well, I'll just go out there and tell everybody something else. Thanks, hon. All right, you know what? Ha! Got him. Ha! Ha! Oh, God, he's got me! Move on, move on! I was going to go to a singles Thanksgiving dinner, but I thought, you know, who wants to sit around and listen to a bunch of pathetic losers go on and on about their boring little lives? No one. Exactly. Hey, you want to see a picture of my new cat, Tiger? Look at this. He likes to watch hockey. Okay, it's going to be a little later than we thought. Oh, oh how late. Well, the turkey's not quite cooked. Oh. <laughs> Judith Priest, it's not even dead. Hi, y'all. He's with us. Look at her go. You'd never know she was ascended by a VW van. Oh, this is ridiculous. It's nine o'clock. Oh, that reminds me. Gotta give the turkey its antibiotics every three hours. You know, you only have to give it a bullet once. Now, Dad, Mr. Finkelstein's just showing some compassion for a wounded animal. Oh, please. It's not an animal. It's groceries. And the least you can do is put the filthy little thing outside. You know, it's not too filthy to eat now, is it? Oh, well, that's I'll nothing. eat it. No, you'll eat anything. I want it. I'll eat it. I simply It happens to be a member of the family. It's not a member of my family. Hey, Pete, why don't you tell everybody your internet name? Tiger's dead. <laughs> Save a bullet for me. <laughs> Man, this is weird. I usually love the smell of onions, but this is making me nauseous. Oh, onions did the same thing to me when I was pregnant with you. <laughs> what? I'm not pregnant. Sure explains why you've been acting so weird lately. I'm not acting weird. Oh, come on. This isn't weird. Dharma, the big dinner and gathering a family together. You're nesting. I'm not pregnant. I couldn't be pregnant. Wait. Oh my god, I could be pregnant. No, I couldn't be pregnant. Oh my god, is it hot in here? I am thinking of a word that begins with the letter B. What is this? Some sort of a game? No, I just thought you'd like to know. I'm thinking of a word beginning with the letter A. Hey, Larry? Nothing. Can I borrow the keys to the van? I gotta run a little errand for Dharma. What does she need? Can't tell you. Oh, come on. Pregnancy test. Why? Well? Oh! You gotta promise not to tell anybody, especially Greg. I understand. Thank you. You may need a push start. Abby's good at it. Come on, useless. I got a job for you. <laughs> no, I mean him. Larry? Fine. Jane went somewhere in your van. She went to get something to eat, didn't she? No. No, she didn't. Then where did she go? Um, I don't have to tell you. You're not the boss of me. Larry, I am drunk and I am starving. And I am not above swinging you about this room by that ratty little ponytail. <laughs> Dom is pregnant. Don't tell Greg. <laughs> Abby, I mean, we've only been married a couple months. What if Greg flips out? I mean, first he had to move into my apartment, and then he had to get used to my dogs, and now we're going to move out of my apartment, and we have to get a minivan. Oh, my God, what if he hates minivans? Dharma, Dharma, hold on, honey. What about you? How do you feel? Me? Me, 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 Okay. I think I'm psyched. Really? Yeah. Oh, good. Because I'm psyched too, and I didn't want to be psyched alone. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 Abby, Abby, you're eating. 
Oh, the hell with the fast. I'm going to be a grandmother. <laughs> oh, the hell with it. I'm going to be a grandmother. <laughs> Dharma pregnant. Yeah. I mean, we used to pretend to be pregnant, but that was just to ride roller coasters and freak people out. <laughs> Doesn't it make you question the emptiness of your life? They had the guts to commit to a relationship, and now they're starting a family. Man, what am I doing? Yeah. I know what you mean. Hey, Jane. Yeah, Pete. What do you say you and me, we give it a shot? I mean a real shot. You know, I would, but I want a trip to Club Med for Christmas, and I really want to stay single for that. <laughs> I'm not saying we couldn't see other people. All right, what's going on? What do you mean? Our parents are getting along great out there. I actually saw my mother kissing your mother. Oh, isn't that nice. Do you like minivans? <laughs> I don't know why. You want to get a minivan? I asked you first. Do you want one? I haven't really thought about it. Well, what if one just showed up on our driveway? I'd probably think it belonged to somebody else. How can you say that? <laughs> Here, take this to the table. Can I bring you back some wine? No, I'm fine. It's really good. No, I can't drink wine. I'm cooking. But thank you. <laughs> My grandchild is not going to be born in a birthing pool. But why not? It's much less traumatic for the baby. Doesn't even know it's out of the womb. Well, it's got to come to grips with it eventually. <laughs> If it were up to you, you'd just yank the boy out and send him off to military school. What makes you think it's going to be a boy? Oh, it's going to be a boy. Well, I, I don't said, think we know that. Oh, there we go. And uh, that's how you make steel. Oh, how interesting. <laughs> um, how is Dharma? She's fine. Is she tired? I don't think so. Well, why don't you go out and give her a hand, son? I'm doing that. <laughs> hey, Greg. Yeah? Way to go. Thanks. Where do you see me carry the hot stuff? <laughs> What's wrong with military school? Look, I don't want my grandson to grow up to be a robot. What's wrong with being a robot? Oh, you know, it would be really cool if the baby were the reincarnation of Mother Teresa. Oh, please, don't be absurd. The Montgomery's never worked directly with the poor. We're the fundraisers. Oh. I didn't that's mean that it would be Mother Teresa. Ah, 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 and that's how you make bail. <laughs> oh, All right, everybody dig in. Oh, sure it is. Good. Hey. Good. Well, oh this looks wonderful. I'm ready. Hey, what happened to the fast? Oh, that was weeks ago, Larry. Really? Great. <laughs> Here's the stuff. Thanks. What stuff? I oh, just got stuff. Oh, boy, stuff. I'll be right back. Oh my god, minivan. Perhaps we should call Dr. Callahan. We have an absolutely excellent OBGYN. Hey, you don't have to spell in front of me. <laughs> Dharma, can, can I come in? Uh-huh. Hi. Hi. Are we getting a minivan? I don't know yet. I'm waiting for the dealer to call me back. <laughs> Do you want a minivan? Well, we've only been married a couple of months, and it's a lot sooner than I thought, but yeah. I absolutely want a minivan, especially if she has your eyes.
What's it say? What did she say? What did she say? Oh, what did she say? Come on, come on. Tell you can't tell me. You can't tell what anybody says if you people won't shut up. It says, um... Nope. You okay? Yeah. It's probably for the best. We're ready, but... They're not. Delicious salad, Jane. Mm. Uh, what happened to my lobster? No, we set him free in your koi pond. <laughs> Well, uh, Jane, what are you doing? Feeding the turkey. Feeding the turkey what? Turkey. Ew! Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh.